foundation. It's a cement factory. Penning Spetsnaz stationed in the northeast against Delta in the southwest. A mixing facility towers over the middle, surrounded by several buildings and open ground for large-scale firefights. Key vantage points surround the environment, situated at various levels for attacks from every angle. Snipers handle best on the high-level walkways. LMGs and assault rifles perform well on the ground and mid-level. Even short-range glasses can land multiple kills when sticking to the inside of confined areas and cutting off incoming movement. Foundation is best broken down into six major locations. Conveyor, warehouse, mixer, office, checkpoint, and pipeline. Positioned away from the main field, Conveyor sets players in a condensed arena, littered with cover points. Navigation can be especially deadly if you don't stop to check your corners, doubly so when approaching objectives. A coordinated team can hold the position for an extended period of time, forcing attackers to guess their position. If you need to break through, a well-placed airstrike will quickly clear the area and send the enemy team packing. To the east, the warehouse overlooks the center of the map. Two buildings and a connecting walkway lend a commanding view of the surrounding area, particularly helpful for taking out enemies en route from one end of the map to the other. You're also given a clear view of office and mixer, opening up the possibility of counter sniping. Just make sure you're not spotted first. If you are, pull out a view within one of the nearby buildings and then realign your attack. In the center, Mixer divides movement across two levels. A fence surrounding the lower level cuts off visuals around the entrances, giving defenders the advantage when holding nearby objectives. A staircase on either side leads to a walkway high above the ground floor, perfect for snipers and other long-range passes. Luckily, they don't have much room to move around, so always check for movement here when positioned on the ground. Directly south, Office offers an equally high vantage point, with views over checkpoint, warehouse, mixer, and pipeline. Again, you sacrifice mobility for an excellent view. It's perfect for a few kills, but get greedy and one of your victims will likely come back for revenge. Consider Dead Silence Pro for when a quick escape is needed. Combined with a tactical insert placed nearby, you'll be back to sniping in no time. At the entrance of the plant, Checkpoint's open layer primarily encourages mid-range combat, with a few choice obstacles breaking up sidelines throughout. A side route leading to Pipeline in the west offers a stealthy approach in, but otherwise, players stationed here have enough room to reliably sit back and cover movement coming from the first four offices or down the main road. Lastly, Pipeline stretches across the east side of the map. If you're using it for travel, be sure to move along the back end to reduce exposure to the middle. A prone position along the front path, however, gives a clear sight straight through the center grounds, in addition to a less conspicuous entry point to Mixer's walkway. Victory and Foundation requires a heightened sense of awareness. The map's abundant verticality poses a threat from above as well as below. If you're fighting from the upper levels, strike quickly and shift position to avoid becoming an easy target. While on the ground, start making a mental checklist of all the popular vantage points. Check for enemies before rushing through, and then focus on threats in front of you. For your strike package, the added abilities granted by specialists can transform you into a particularly lethal asset for your team. The open layout means less overall danger from moment to moment. Rewarding careful play and an extended lifeline throughout. Throw in Assassin, Blind Eye, Sit Rep, and other defensive packs, and you'll be a hard target to take down. Ensure your loadouts have a strong mixture of ranged capabilities to best handle the current battle. While long range weapons may seem the go to for success in each match, 
Other playstyles can perform just as successfully given the right positioning and attack strategy. With a few matches under your belt, you'll have a better sense of the map's layout and build the foundation needed to start tallying up wins.